Hello, my name is Oksana. This is emelinga.com. Today we are going to, to, to train past perfect. The lesson is devoted to grammar. Now we are making the pause while the students are gathering to today's class. Hello, Michael. How are you? Hello? Hello, Michael. How are you? I'm okay. What about How was you? your day? Have you been busy? Mm, not much. Not much. Did you stay at home or uh, did you go anywhere today? No, today I was at home. I have been at home. Mm -hmm. I don't. I don't hear you very well. Anything wrong with uh, the microphone? Can you hear me? Okay. Can you hear me? No? Yes. yes? It was. <clears throat> I don't hear you very well. That's why I ask you all the time. Today we are going to talk about grammar material, about past perfect. Can you give me an example of past perfect? The sentence in past perfect? Past perfect. Uh, past perfect. Uh, in, I don't remember. It's... it's uh, uh, as I say, maybe I have been at home or what? This is present perfect. I have been. Present. Okay. present perfect. Perfect. Instead of have, we have to use had. Uh -huh. Yes. This is the action that was completed before the other action in the past. Uh -huh. So, let's try to train a little. <coughs> Here is the link for you. So, can you open it? One second. Yes, I open. Good. So, let's try to do this exercise, past simple or past perfect. The first uh, sentence, by the time we, everyone had left, arrived or had arrived? Uh, one second. Um, by the time we... Uh, mm, 
had arrived. We have already had in this sentence. Uh -huh. Everyone had left. Yes. So the first action is everyone had left, and the second is we arrived. So at first they left, and then we arrived. Do uh -huh. you understand? That's why we use present uh, past simple in this case. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. By the time we arrived, everyone had left. Okay. The second sentence, I, a long time ago, finished, had finished, or uh, both variants, either could be used. Uh, I finished a long time ago. I finished a ago. long time ago. Why do you think it's the correct variant? Because it's uh, past simple. Mm. We've got no, the... No, 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 nothing special. Mm, yes. Yes. Mary, hello, how are you? Hello, I'm fine. How are you? I see that uh, the sound is doubled. I don't know what is going on. Maybe something goes wrong. I didn't know, but I hear it. Ivan, hello. How are you? Turn on the mic. Okay. <laughs> it's it, it's like crazy variant uh, use only text uh, when when we speak with you, <laughs> but I don't know. Yes, I'll try to do it. Uh, maybe we, we, we need to focus here on the lesson, and if Ivan uh, want uh, to join us, uh, the, uh, maybe by microphone or <laughs> so, something like that. Yeah. Good. Good. So, Mary, uh, do you remember past perfect? How to use it and how to form it? Uh, we use this time uh, when we talk about something previous in the past. Something what happens previous than something else. And uh, it's formulated uh, 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 verb have in the past time and uh, main verb in part participle too. Yeah, right. Can you give me an example? Um, uh, I had eat, eaten my breakfast uh, and uh, go in the work. And went to work. Uh, and went to work. Good, well done. And um, my work. Can you put, can a, you question? put a question? Um, um had you went to no, work? No, 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 no. Try to I think one time. Uh, uh, okay. okay. So the sentence? Oh. oh. Have? Have? Uh, uh, it's so terrible. Yes, yes, it is very terrible. Maybe you've got two windows uh, open from uh, Emelingo. Try to. No, oh, but now to everything is okay. Now everything is much better. Yes, that's that's good. It is possible to talk now. Yes. Right. So, can you give me the sentence that is an example? Uh, yeah. Had uh, you eaten your breakfast before you went? Before you went to work. To work. Good. And the negative sentence? Uh, I uh, had not eaten my breakfast <laughs> before I go. I went to work. To work. Yes. Well done. Good. Now follow the link here. We've got the test. Can you open the site? Yes. Good. 
So the first sentence, by the time we, everyone had left. Arrived or had arrived? What do arrived. you choose? Arrived, yes. What action is the first? Uh, first, uh, everyone had left. And then we arrived. Yes, exactly, you're right. The second sentence, I, a long time ago, finished or had finished or I, either could be used here. What do you choose? Finished. Finished, this past simple. Yes. Yes. We've got the indication of time a long time ago. A sentence number three, by the time everybody exhausted. Mm. By that time, к тому времени, oh, okay, everybody had been exhausted. Was exhausted. We've got oh, the okay. indication of time, so by that time, oh. everybody okay. was exhausted. When we have uh, two actions to compare, we should use past perfect. When we do not have actions to compare, we use past simple. Okay. She told she, me she it ages ago did had done or. Either could be used here. Uh, had done. We have two action. She told and uh, had done it ages ago. Yes. So uh, first uh, she had done it, and after that she told. Yes, you're right. So <coughs> next sentence. I of it until you mentioned it. Didn't hear or hadn't heard? I hadn't heard. Hadn't heard of it until you mentioned it. Yeah, right. Number six. Uh, uh, I, uh, I didn't have enough time to finish the exam. Okay. I see that we've got one more student, Tim. Hello, Tim, how are you? Can you hear me? Hello, of course. Can you turn on your mic to be able to talk? Do you have a mic? Do you have a microphone? Is it possible to talk? Well, I don't know. No. So we have to uh, find a microphone to be able to talk during the lesson. Good. And in this case, yes, I speak Russian. Я говорю по-русски, да, Иван? Но, к сожалению, мы с вами не можем пообщаться. Да, я вижу, а что на, на, на вашем аватаре написано имя, потому я вас к вам так обращаю. Да, Валерия, я специально спрашивал у вас, не признаю. Хорошо, Валерия. Окей, Мне очень а, жаль, а, вам нужно быть, будет найти микрофон, чтобы... Смотрите, Don't hear you. Не слышно. Да, да. Ну, я как бы хотел то же самое сказать про микрофон, пожалуйста. Что сначала как бы где-то там найдите наушники или просто включите. Можете даже на русском что-то сказать, если вы прям не можете. Правильно? Да, правильно, все правильно. Окей. Okay. What next? So, Mary... Do you hear me? Yes. Good. Let's go on with our test. Uh, I uh, uh, I had uh, I think it's a uh, two uh, a second option because we have I had and had uh, enough time to finish the exam. The exam. Okay. I didn't have enough time to finish the exam because didn't it's a fact. Mm -hmm. Fact. 
Okay. Not the action. Fact. Number seven, if you might have helped. Uh, if you, if I, oh, if I, если бы я знала об этом, я бы вам помогла. I think it's if I know. Yes. If, if I had knew. known, if I had known, I'd helped. Oh, oh, oh because it's before yes. happened. Okay. Next number eight. If I. Uh, if I, if I had no, I tell you. If I knew, I'd tell you. Uh, in the previous case, I had known, I would have helped. Yes, Th this is conditional sentence. One of the uh -huh. conditionals. Do you remember? Unreal condition from conditional sentences, from the topic of conditional sentences. Do you remember? Uh, we we going to speak for this topic in next week, in this, yes, week, oh, yes. in this week. And in uh, case number eight, if I knew, I'd... Yeah, okay. I, I would tell, I'd tell you. you. Good. Number nine, Mary. Uh, no sooner uh, he, uh, than I realized what was going on. Uh, had I arrived, uh, no sooner had I arrived than I realized what was going on. Okay. We have two action. So first I arrive and after that I uh, what was going on, understand. Good. You're right. Number ten. Until last month, I it before. Uh, I didn't try it before. I hadn't. I hadn't. Last month, I hadn't tried it before. Uh, but we have one action, yes. Uh, yes, but it is the result of the action. The kind of the result of the action in past. So it's uh, past perfect. Past yes. perfect, yes, you're right. Okay. Now I'd like you to refresh some theory in your memory. <coughs> we already talked about this topic, but to refresh it and to, to know it better, let's try to do it. So to form past perfect, we use uh, auxiliary web head. In observe uh, verb have in past it is had plus past participle. For example, Mary, you're welcome. You you had studied English before you moved to New York. Mm -hmm. And uh, question to put the question we have to use. Had you studied English before you moved to New York? Yes. And uh, one more sentence. You had not studied English before you moved to New York. Okay, New York. And the uses. The first use of uh, past perfect is completed action before something in the past. Mary, you're welcome. The past perfect. The, the past perfect express, expresses the idea that something uh, occurred uh, before uh, occurred uh, before another action in the past. If uh, it can uh, also show that sometimes happened before, a spe uh, a specific. Specific, specific time in the past. For example, Examples. Uh, I had never seen such a beautiful beach uh, before I went to Kauai. 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 Yes. Uh, next sentence. Yes. Okay. I didn't uh, have any money. I did. I did not have any money because I had lost my uh, wallet. Wallet? Wallet. Uh, Tony Another knew... Of this word? Wallet? Pocket. Pocket. Kosherok. Wallet. Yes, uh, I know. Good. Next sentence. Tony? Uh, Tony know uh, Istanbul so well because uh, he had visit, visited the city several times. 
Yes. Herr Chuzan ever uh, studied uh, Thai? Thai? Thai before mm -hmm. she moved uh, on Thailand. To Thailand. To Thailand. Uh, she only understood uh, the movie because she had read uh, the book. Uh, Christine he had never been to an oper opera before uh, last night. We were not able to get a hotel room because we had not uh, booked in uh, advance. 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 Uh, had you ever visited the USA before your uh, trip, trip in uh, trip uh, 2006? Yes, I had been uh, to the USA once before. Thank you. Good. Well done. And the second use, duration before something in the past, non-continuous verbs. So when we have got the action in the past and uh, we have got the verb that is not used in continuous form, we also use past perfect. Right? Let's yes. read the explanation of this. Very uh, non uh non-continuous verb uh, and some non-continuous use to mix at verbs. We use the past uh, perfect to show uh, that something started in the past and continue, continued up until another action in the past. Examples, we had had uh, that uh, car for 10 years before it broke, broke down. Uh, by the time Alex finished his uh, studies, he had been in London for over eight years. They eight. left uh, eight years. They left bed about uh, selling uh, the house because they had owned uh, it for more than four year, for forty years. Yes, well done. Good. Although the above use of past perfect is normally limited to non-continuous verbs and non-continuous uses of mixed verbs, the verb words live, work, teach and study are sometimes used in this way even though they are not non-continuous verbs. So we have to remember about it. Important specific times with the past perfect. Let's try to read it. So, Mary, you're welcome. Unlike the present perfect? Uh, unlike this, uh, the present perfect, it is possible to use special, uh, specific, specific time words uh, or uh, phrases. Phrases. Phrases uh, with the past perfect. Uh, also, also, this is possible. Also. Although. 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 Although uh, this is possible, uh, it is usually not necessary. Example: She had visited her Japanese uh, relatives once in 1993 before she moved in uh, uh, in with them in 1996. Yes. <coughs> Go on. Moreover, uh, moreover, uh, if the past perfect action did occur uh, at a specific occur occur in a specific time occur at a specific time, the simple past can be used uh, instead of the past perfect when before or after uh, is used in the uh, sentence. The words before and after actually tell you what happens first. Uh, so the past perfect is uh, option optional. Uh, for this reason both sentences below are correct. Correct. Are correct. So we can use both tenses sometimes, past perfect and past simple, as we can see from the example. She had visited her Japanese relatives once in 1993 before she moved in with them in 1996. Or she visited her Japanese relatives once in 1993 before she moved in with them in 1996. Do you understand it, Mary? Yes, I understand. Good. However, Let's read more. However, if the past perfect is not referring uh, to an action at the specific time, past perfect is not uh, optional. Uh, compare the examples below. Here, uh, here past perfect is referring to a, uh, a lack of experience rather than experience mm -hmm. rather uh, than an action at a specific time. For this reason, simple past cannot be used. For example, for example, she never saw uh, a view before she moved bear, to bear before she moved bear, to Alaska. Bear before she moved to Alaska. 
Uh, not correct. Uh, she had never seen a bear, bear a before. Bear, bear uh, before she moved to Alaska. Do you understand it? Can you paraphrase it in your own words? Uh, it's show um, uh, show uh, so, uh, uh, so shows to us. us. Shows us. It shows, shows us. us. It shows us lack of experience. Lack if of you experience. had uh, had not done something before, before yes. Good, well done. And uh, adverb placement. Adverb placement. Uh, the examples below uh, show the uh, placement for uh, grammar uh, adverb. Adverbs such as uh, always, only, never, ever, still, uh, just, etc. Example: uh, You ha uh, you had previously studied English before you moved to New York. Had you previously studied English before you moved to New York? Yes, thank you. Well done. And active and passive. For example. Exam well, uh, George had uh, repaired many cars before uh, he uh, rece received his received 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 his uh, Mechanic machine, uh, machi mechanics mechanics license. license. Active and uh, many cars had been repaired active, uh, by, mm -hmm. active uh, by George before uh, he received his uh, me mechanic license. License. Passive. Yes. And uh, now I'd like you to give your sentence in the passive voice of uh, past perfect. Uh, okay. Um, uh, mm, I, I don't know <laughs> what. Uh, the books uh, had uh, been uh, had yes. hadn't mm. had been hadn't. Uh, had been uh, read it. Had been read. Uh, had been read. Read. Uh, read. 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 Yes, had been read. Had been read uh, mm -hmm. before um, it uh, it was in shop. <laughs> before it was didn't buy it. <laughs> it was bought. Be before it was, it was bought. bought. Yes. Good. One more example. Um, okay. The build had been built. The building had been built. Uh, had been built. Yes. Yes. Uh, mm, oh, oh no, maybe the build had been. Oh yes, the build had been <laughs> built. Didn't the build. build had been built. Had been built uh, before uh, architecture. Not uh, uh, don't made. No, no. Uh, the building had been built before. Before architecture. I, arri I arrived to this oh. city, for example. Okay. I arrived to the city. Good, good. Well done. We've got uh, one more. Student, hello, Nastya. Anastasia, can you talk? Could you please introduce yourself? There is name Nastyona in your profile. Could you please introduce yourself? Okay, no answer. So maybe another time. Good. <coughs> now I'd like you to try to, to do some more exercises. Click on the link and open open it. Mary, could you please open? Yes. Page 81. Mm -hmm. Past progressive versus past perfect directions. Complete the sentences with the words in parentheses. Use the past progressive or the past perfect. Let's try to read the example. First sentence, Mary. When I left for school this morning, I uh, was uh, raining. It it, uh, was it was it was raining, so I used my umbrella. Good. And the second sentence. By the time. By the time class was over the, uh, this morning, the rain had stopped, so I didn't need my umbrella anymore. 
What kind of action do we have in the first sentence? It's uh, past continuous. Past continuous. So the, the action is in process. Yes. And uh, in the second sentence, what kind of action is it? Past perfect. Past perfect. What kind of action is it? Uh, it's uh, complete. Completed action in the past. action, yes. Do you differentiate between the, these two actions? Do you know the difference? Do you understand it? Uh, the first uh, action was a long time and uh, the, I don't know, somebody uh, use, must or have to, have to? Have to use umbrella because it's a long time. But in uh, second case, uh, the person uh, didn't have to use umbrella because uh, this action was completed. Completed, yes. Well done. Good of you. Let's do the exercise. Uh, last night, I, last night, I studied uh, to study. Uh, I started to study at seven thirty. Uh, Dick uh, come at uh, seven thirty-five. Mm -hmm. I uh, was studying when Dick come. Game. Game. So the action was still going on when Dick came to yes. her. Sentence number four. Last night, uh, last night I started to study at seven thirty. I finished study at nine. Then, uh, then came uh, came. came came at nine thirty. By the time then came, I had finished my homework. Yes, well done. Good. When I walked into the kitchen after dinner last night, my wife uh, was washing the dishes, so I picked up a dish, towel, and helped her. Good. Continues. Uh, by the time I walked into the kitchen after dinner uh, tonight, my husband uh, had already had already washed washed, yes. washed the dishes uh, and uh, put them away. Put them away. Completed yes. action. Yes, completed action. Yeah, right. Next exercise. Direction, read the passage and underline the past perfect verbs and they are modifying adverbs always and never. Then complete the sentences that follow the passage. Use the past perfect in your completions. So let's try to do it, Mary. You're welcome. Okay. Uh, Alan Green uh, got married for the first time at uh, age 39. He, uh, he, 49. He, 49. 49. Uh, his new li life is very different, different because he ha uh, he has had to change many old hobbies, habits. Habits. For example, before his mar uh, his marriage, he had always watched TV during dinner, but uh, his wife likes uh, to talk at dinner time. So now it uh, now the TV is off. Okay. <coughs> what I must do? So the first sentence is an example. We have to underline okay. or uh, say where where do we have uh, past perfect. In this sentence, we have got had always okay. watched. Good. It is an example. The second sentence, until his marriage. Until his marriage, Alan had uh, always uh, read. Uh, he had always read the, fr uh, the front page of the newspaper first, but his wife uh, likes to read the read front read the front page first. So uh, two uh, first two. So now Alan reads the read the reads the sport page first. Mm -hmm. Where do we have past perfect? Uh, we have. Past perfect in oh in uh, Alan had read 
red. Head always red. Yes. Head right. always red. The sport page first. Yes. The front page first. The front page first. You're right. Next sentence number three. Until he got married. Uh, until he got married, he he had never uh, let let, okay. let any anyone all, uh, else choose the radio station in the car. He had always listened to uh, except exactly exactly what he wanted to listen to. But his wife likes to choose uh, what on the radio when she's in the car with him. Mm -hmm. Where do we have past perfect here? He had never let. Yes, you're right. Next sentence. When he was a bachelor, bachelor mm -hmm. Alan had uh, always left his uh, dirty sh socks uh, on the floor. Uh, now uh, he pick uh, them up and uh, pa puts, 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 puts them in the uh, laundry basket. basket. Mm -hmm. Alan had basket. always left. Yes, you're right. Next sentence. Uh, before he was married, he uh, he hid. Yes. He'd never put, uh, put. the cap, cap. Put, put put cap the cap back on the uh, toothpaste. Mm -hmm. He left it off. His wife uh, prefer uh, prefers to have the uh, cap back cap. on. Cap back on. She always squeezes squeezes from the uh, bottom of the uh, tube, tube uh, and Ellen doesn't. Mm -hmm. Ellen can't remember to put the cap, uh, the cap, uh, the cap back on. Uh, so now uh, they have a separated toothpaste separate toothpaste tubes. tubes. Uh, he he'd never put Yes, good, well done. Next sentence, number six. Alan had never shared uh, the TV remote uh, control remote con control with anyone uh, before he uh, got married. He still likes to have control of the TV remote, uh, but he doesn't say anything uh, when he uh, when his wife use, uses it. Mm -hmm. Where do we have past? Perfect here. Alan had never shared. Shared. So, no. what do you think about Alan Green? Is he happy? I don't know. <laughs> I think uh, he uh, he make very much sacrifice. He has made uh, lots of sacrifice, right, to his oh, wife. Lots of sacrifice. Good. Um, and what about his wife? Do you think that uh, she is happy? I I think yes. I think uh, she is a uh, hot leader in this marriage. The wife is the leader. Am I right? Yes. <laughs> okay. Dominant person. You're yeah, right. Sometimes it happens. Let's try to do the next exercise. Complete the sentences. The first sentence. Until Alan got married, he had always watched TV during the dinner. Number two. Before. Before his marriage. Uh, before his marriage, he. Uh, I uh, have to. to find in the. Find in the text. Oh, okay. Yes. The past perfect. Uh, before. His marriage. His marriage. He uh, had uh, always read the front page the of the newspaper of newspapers first. first. Yes, you're right. Well done. Number three. Uh, prior. 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 Uh, to getting married, he he let. Yes, he had always let uh, other people choose the uh, station on his. Car radio. Maybe he had never. Oh, left. he had never let mm -hmm. other people oh. choose the station on his car radio. And before, until he began, until he began married life. He uh, had always put 
-hmm. his uh, dirty socks on on the floor. Good. Next sentence. Before, uh, before yeah. getting married, he had uh, pu never put the toothpaste cap back on. The toothpaste uh, cap back on. Yes. Until he had a wife who also liked uh, to use the TV remote channel, he uh, had. I don't remember the last. Choose. Yes. He had never, or he had always choose the remote with anyone. He had never shared. Oh, shared, yes. Right? Yes. Next exercise, verb tense review. Complete the sentences with the words in parentheses. You enjoyed, did you enjoy the concert last night? Very much. I hadn't, I uh, hadn't gone to a concert in a long time. Next sentence. Uh -huh. Okay. Uh, did you, uh, did you see? Uh, John yesterday. Yeah. Yes, I did. Uh, it uh, had had been. It had been good. It to had been uh, good to see him again. Uh, I hadn't see. Uh, I hadn't seen him in uh, in a long time. Time. Yes. Well done. Good of you. Nice. Number three. Uh, hi, Jim. Uh, it's good to see you again. I uh, I hadn't see, seen yes, I hadn't see, uh, seen you in in weeks. Uh, hi, I, I didn't see you in weeks. A uh, first sentence is past uh, simple. Past simple. Past simple. Oh, okay. Okay. I didn't see you in weeks. I didn't see you. Yes. Mm. I see you. Uh, I see you. It had been good to see you again, too. Uh, I had had I hadn't seen you uh, since the since end of the last semester. Since, since uh, the end of the, of last semester. How everything going? How's everything going? Yes, well done. Number four. You get to class on time yesterday morning. Uh, do you get to class? Did, oh, did did you get, did you get to, to class, class to, on time yesterday on morning? On time yesterday morning. No. no by uh, the time I uh, had uh, get got there, there, got, got, got there. there, it uh, had already. By the time I got there, it had already. Began. Began, yes. Mm -hmm. Because it, first it began and uh, later I got there. Do you understand? Oh, okay. Uh, I got Yeah, Yes, I understand. Right. Next sentence, number five. Next dialogue. I called Anna. Uh, but I couldn't talk to her. Why not? Why not? Uh, she had already gone. She had bed. already gone to bed. Gone her to sister bed. sister didn't want to wake her up for a phone call. Good. Yes. Next sentence. You a wonderful artist. I love you. Watercolor painter, painters uh, of the rural valley. Thank you. I had painted the same valley many times because it has such uh, uh, interesting light at different times uh, of the day. Good. Next sentence. I had a scare yesterday. I uh, I was watching the Thank new you. the okay. new when I uh, when a tornado warning flashed on the screen. Mm -hmm. Continuous time, yes. Yes. Uh, I watched. I watched. I'm watching. Oh, I was watching. I was watching. So I was watching is better because the process. Yes, the long action. I was watching. Good. 
What do you do? Uh, what do you do? Oh, what, what did you do? Did you do? Так. Yes, uh, I... I had run to the bathroom of the house. Basement, to the basement. Yes, to the basement. basement of the house. To the of basement the of the house. Good, number eight. Uh, did you go out? Did you go? Last... Did you go out to eat last night? Oh yes. Did you uh, did you go out to eat last night? Mm -hmm. uh, by the time I uh, I had no. get I no. had got no no I got home by the time oh, I got okay. home. I understand. I got home. My uh, I got home. My husband uh, had already made dinner for us. For us. Yes. Well done. Next. Uh, how did you be? How was it? How was it? Oh, how was it? Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. Terrific. We had. We, we had, had chicken, chicken rice, and, uh, and salad. salad. While we uh, eaten, we were eating. While uh, we were eating, George drug uh, stopped stopped by, by to, to visit us. us. So we uh, so we interviewed him. To invited, to invited, uh, invited him to join us for dinner. Dinner, yes, good, well done. And error. we had had chicken, yes. Yes, you're right. The first is uh, perfect. Yes, the second is perfect. Past perfect. We yes. had had yes. chicken rice and salad. Well, we. Okay. Were eaten, Can stopped, you? and invited him for to join us for dinner. Good. Next exercise: error analysis. Directions correct their errors. Let's, let's try to correct the errors in this exercise. The first sentence: Where have you been? I have been waiting for you for an hour. The second sentence: Mary. But it's not uh, um, uh, past perfect. <laughs> Yes. It's not past perfect, it's the revision of tenses in general. Uh, okay. <clears throat> uh, Anna has been a soccer fan uh, since 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 long time. Anna had been. Yes? Yes. Anna had been a soccer fan since a long time. Has been, not have been, oh, has been. Had. Okay. Since I have been a child, I like to solve puzzles. Uh, Since I have I, been a child, I I like to I like uh, I like to solve, solve puzzles. Yes. Do you understand the sentence? It's a present. Yes, in the, the first part of the sentence, I have been present perfect. And, yes, uh, and I like this is present. I like, I like to solve puzzles. Good. But it can be past. I liked, but maybe I don't like anymore. Since I had been a child, I liked to solve this puzzles. Had Since been. I have been. I like to solve puzzles. Mm -hmm. Good. Have you ever wanted to travel around the world? What mistake is in this sentence? Have you ever maybe wanted? Yes, you're right. Have you ever wanted to travel around the world? Can you translate the sentence? Вы когда-нибудь хотели путешествовать вокруг мира, вокруг света? You're right. Have you ever had such a dream to travel around the world? Yes, I think. I think everyone. Yes. Why not? The family is at the hospital since they hear about the accident. What mistake is in this sentence? The family is at the hospital. Uh, it's hospital since they had, had heard. Hear. They have heard. 
or have heard about the accident. Accident. Okay. My sister is only 30 years old, but her hair has begun to turn gray. Uh, My sister okay. is only 30 years old, but her hair... Her hair... Mm. Is... No. Begins to turn gray. Oh, okay, yes, I understand. Not, I'm not understand. You don't has understand. begins? No, simply begins to turn gray. Not oh. has begun. Oh. Begins uh, to turn gray. Is changing to gray. Okay. Number seven, Jake. Jake has been working as a volunteer at the uh, child uh, children's hospital several times. Uh, I, maybe it's a uh, past perfect. Jack had been. Oh no. So, past perfect continues. Yes, so let's try to change the sentence. Jack had been working as a volunteer well, at the children's hospital. Children's hospital several times. Yes? Jack has worked, has worked as a volunteer at the children's hospital several times. Uh, here we've got the result of the action. Mm -hmm. Jack okay. has worked. Работал. Uh, okay. okay, next sentence. Steve? Uh, Steve has worn his black suit, his, uh, black suit uh, only once since he since has since. bought since he has bought it. Uh, Steve, it's, oh, okay. Uh, I, Steve has worn, worn his back suit only once since he since, had, since. since he had bought it. Bought it. Okay, number nine. My cousin um, is studying for medical school exams since last month. Is studying for medical school exams since last month. Uh, my cousin... I don't... can find... Has been studying for medical school exams since last month. Not is studying or has been studying. Okay. Is studying is present continuous? Uh, has been studying. It just started studying oh, and it's still I, studying. I understand. The students are hearing rumors about their teacher's engagement for a week. The teachers? The students? The students are hearing rumors the teacher's engagement. What is this engagement? Engagement. Uh, engagement. Oh, oh, okay. okay. Yes. The students are hearing rumors about their teacher's engagement for a week. The students uh, has hearing have, have, have her have have hearing have rumors. Heard. Have heard. Oh, have heard. Have rumor. heard rumors have about heard. teachers. Mm -hmm. Because here is not used in continuous. Oh, okay. So have have heard. Heard. Good. I don't know the results of my medical tests already. I'll find out soon. Uh, uh, I hadn't know. Uh, it's two action. Yes. Yes. So first, I uh, I had I haven't know. known. Yes. Known. I haven't know known. Yes. The result of my medical test already. Go uh, or not? I uh, I haven't already know. Yes. I haven't can already see. known the no. result of my medical tests. Good. Next sentence number twelve. Jean. Uh, Jean has been try to get uh, uh, online to go internet shopping for an hour. Jean. Try 
He has been trying. He has been trying oh. to get. It's uh, present continuous. Continuous. Present grammar continuous. Yes, you're right. Number 13. By the time Michelle uh, unlocked the door, her door her apartment. and got into the her apartment, her phone already stopped run, uh, running. So by the time Michelle uh, had unlocked the door, and got into the into her apartment. Her phone already stopped ringing. Vice versa, different. Uh, so in the uh, next sentence, had already stopped ringing. She unlocked, ah. and the phone had already stopped ringing. Ah, yes, because it's first. Yes, I understand. Good. So. Uh, was it interesting to uh, learn some more facts about past perfect today for you? What yes. new information have you received? Oh, we have another more student. <laughs> yes, Maria. Hello, how are you? Oh, I'm fine. How are you? Fine, thank you. Today we are, we have been talking about past perfect. Are you familiar with this topic? I guess. So what do you know about past perfect? Where do we use it? And how do we form it? Oh, I can explain. What auxiliary verb do we use to form past perfect? Had. Had. Yes, you're right. And can you give me an example? I had... Я прочла эту книгу перед тем, как он пришел. Я прочла ли я книгу in past perfect? Uh, had I read the book? Yes. And the negative sentence? I hadn't read the book. I hadn't read the book before he came. Yes, okay. you're right. And when do we use uh, this tense form? Um, we use this tense form when we want to talk about something that had happened in the past. Um, yes, you're right. But when we try to compare two actions that took place in the past, the action th that took place before is uh, marked by past. Perfect. Do you agree? Yes. Good of you. Good. Well done. So it is the end of today's class. So maybe it's next time. <laughs> yes, uh, maybe next time uh, you'll come earlier and we'll have the opportunity to train a little bit more and to do some more exercises. Oksana, yes? Can you send me the file uh, that you have um, exercises that you have done, please? Yes, sure, yes, I can do it. I can send you a link. So here it is. Here is one link and uh, the theory is also here. I can't find it. Just a minute. I'm fine. I can. Ah, uh, yes, Mary. So I have also found it. Oh, here it is, yes. This is the theory about past perfect and the exercises that we have covered today. I hope that uh, you'll try to, to do them individually and I'm waiting for you next time. Be sure to have a nice evening and uh, uh, there will be some more classes today at emelinga.com so you're welcome to visit. Mm -hmm. Bye for now. No questions. Bye for now. Thank you for listening. Bye-bye. Thank you.